with regards to wormholes is there any mention of wormholes in the quran so first of all that einstein gave this theory of general relativity and he also gave this concept of shortcuts or he called bridges in the space time through which two points in universe are connected that is uh, the bridge which connects two points which are very far away in the universe to each other so he called them bridges so uh, the concept of wormhole that is through which uh, anyone can travel from one point to another in in universe in a very short time so that concept is there about wormholes so uh, quran mentions this in terms of relativity of time also about this wormhole quran mentions in surah ma'arij ma'arij in uh, surah number 70 ayat number 3 4 allah talks about the punishment on, on the day of judgment allah says that min allah dhil ma'arij that from allah who is zil uh, ma'arij lord of the ways of ascent or the stairways that is in the heavens the ways of ascent in the heavens or the stairways in the heavens allah says ta'rujul next verse ta'rujul malaikatu warruhu ilayhi fi yawmin kana miqdaru 50 alf sana that the angels and the spirit they ascend unto him they ascend unto him uh, in a day the measure of which is 50000 years 50 alf sana that is a day equivalent to 50000 years here the relativity of time is mentioned and here only that this stairways in the heavens through which the angels the creatures of the beings of light are traveling that is uh, they are traveling through these stairways they are ma'arij allah says ta'rujul malaikatu warruhu they travel through these stairways which einstein called as bridges in the space time so uh, these ways through uh, that is a day equivalent to 50000 years in these uh, ma'arij that is these stairways so uh, this is mentioned in connection to the relativity of time so about these wormholes there is some in, there is this indication is there in the quran so we still we don't know the exact nature of the wormhole also but we know that time slows when there is mass effect of massive gravity time slows down or if uh, accelerating with a high speed time slows down so time is actually relative and uh, it is according to one's own reference each have different perception of time with its own reference so in uh, here the case of relativity of time is mentioned and also these uh, talked about these stairways in heavens through which the angels are traveling and this concept of bridges were was given first by einstein that is uh, uh, when he propounded his theory of general relativity so this is mentioned in the quran further it's mentioned in the quran in surah hijr surah number 15 ayat number 14 that uh, talks about those who don't believe that walau fatahna alaihim babam min as-sama'i fazallu fihi ya'rujun that allah says that even if we in, uh, open a gate in the heaven through which they ascend through which they if they ascend and uh, into the heavens uh, still they will not believe bal nahnu qaumun mashhurun they will say that we are a people who are bewitched if they if allah were to open a gate in the heavens through which they travel and even if they travel through that they will come to say that we are bewitched that we have been uh, affected by sorcery so this is what they will say those who don't want to believe so quran clearly mentions that there are Uh, gates in the heavens or there are uh, ways of ascent the quran says ma'arij that is the stairways or the bridges or wormholes they are there through which angel travels and the traveling in this is like a uh, one day is equivalent to the 50000 that is uh, years on earth so that we can understand because it it may have a ma- effect of massive gravity or acceleration so Uh, so such concepts are there but again they are beyond our limit scope of understanding all these things they are from also from unseen ghaib we don't know how actually these things works or maybe we will be able to discover all all these things so maybe we may um, discover more about these things but clearly we will not be able to solve the total mysteries that are out there 
so if uh, we say that we will be able to discover god uh, through science it's very difficult to say that we will be able to discover or any proof we can do because science is based upon uh, the experiments or uh, observing something and experimenting uh, on them so there are uh, still there are things we are not able to grasp with our understanding so the indication about these uh, wormholes is there in the quran that is about the ways of ascend that the angels who are creatures created from light and they travel through them and the and these uh, uh, the stair these stairways that is the ma'arij they are mentioned with respect to the relativity of time also so this relativity of time is there in the quran and also about these the bridges or these stairways in the heavens 